to come down with me but he was taking way too long and one thing about me if i have a goal and i don't wake up and start getting to it i will start doing different things it's 9 45 i should be done i give me like an hour and a half let's see boom check me out check me out boom bam bam bop but it is 10 26 and i'm done actually i just realized i'm not done because i forgot that zavi sasa sent me his version of the video that he ended up recording <sighs> well, that shouldn't take any more than like five minutes so i'm gonna head upstairs and then start my day and finish my videos that i started a long time ago and that type of stuff all right so i did my makeup slight stuff i don't like my eyebrows i completely redo them like i told y'all in another video because i feel like they're too dark for my current hair color but we're at lennox with it it's so blurry i don't like how blurry it is i don't know why it's so blurry it's so annoying i went to sephora got a bunch of stuff because they had a a 20 percent deal and it's not like 20 percent off your whole purchase it's 20 percent off of everything that you buy i smell food so i'm getting hungry but it's so packed in the mall like super packed i've never seen it this packed before i gotta go home make some videos just had to grab some things we'll see what happens next so back at home with it Why do you have to be so obnoxious? So, I got a couple shirts, Adidas, doesn't matter. I really wanted to go to the Ugg store, but there was like a long line for no reason. Actually, it was a good reason. There were like rainbow Uggs, there were like highlighter, colorful Uggs, like there were like green Uggs. Before. So I'm gonna show you what I've got. I'm not gonna tell you the prices because we all know that when you shop for makeup and stuff, you just gonna spend a check. I spent about 210 in total. I got beauty blender cleanser, even though my Instagram story put me on to baby shampoo. I also wanted to try something else, like high-end brand, you know? Black African soap works just as good. I just wanted to buy something at this point because it really made no sense as to why I bought that. Then I got the NARS foundation. I've been seeing a couple videos with girls with NARS foundation and it's like a yellow tone. I think there's like yellow tones in a lot of foundations, but somebody used NARS and I really love their results. So I'm like, let me get some. My vein color is blue green so i can go towards the warm side i can go towards the cool side but i always stay towards the ne neutral because i'm both but um sometimes i look too washed out and too like pale to me so i'm like mm, let me try nars and see what happens let me know if you try nars what you think if you guys run into makeup tiktok a lot you guys see the bright neon liquid liners and just the bright makeup in general it's not summer anymore so you're probably not gonna see that much but i really love colors and um i just thought i'd get these these are the best ones that they had in sephora it's called the anastasia beverly hills norvani i think this is a collaboration collection i'm not sure but they have three different colors in each boxes i was really confused at first i was really inspired by this nyx white eyeliner that i did today that's so many compliments and i'm like yes sis because if you look close it's like the lines are not super crispy and straight because my hands be like shaking and stuff but i got compliments so that's all that matters oh and then i got a uh, um a uh, cologne that we both found that was like smelling really good so i'm like i can't pass that up because if i like it and you like it ain't no reason to not have it you know what i mean Yummy! But in the meantime, I'm probably about to do my hair. Cause I gotta do this promo. Good morning! So it's a few days later and I'm on my way to the dealership and I brought my iPad so that I could edit some videos but the problem with that is that um the charger is not working and I'm about to be late. Literally, well, I'm on time. 
but if I go to Best Buy to get what I have to get, I'm going to be late. So basically, I just have to sit there and maybe I'll just be on my phone and scroll and try to find some challenges to do and get organized and stuff like that. They ended up giving me a loaner car because they said it's going to take a few hours, so I guess this is going to help put me ahead. So first thing I'm going to do is go to Best Buy, then I don't know what else I'm going to do. So. In a second. After sitting in my car or the rental, whatever, for a whole hour, I got a phone call saying that my car was done, but I still need to stop at Target, so I'm about to go in. I got some heels on, but they're pretty comfortable, more comfortable than I thought, except for my heel keeps pushing outwards, so it's like making me walk weird, so I keep having to adjust it. If you know how to fix that, let me know now in the comments, because of course those are off, but like in my DM or something. Here is the outfit of the day. I look like a crackhead, and I'm whispering, because it's so quiet. I honestly look like a hot mess, but whatever. Leave it up to me to get things that I don't need but want. Honestly, the only reason why I threw orange with this is because it's the only hat I had and my hair. I was having a bad hair day because I've been stalling on my wash and go. So yeah, that's why I look like this. But I guess it's time to add to the collection. I just don't know what color. I decided I want to Hi, can I order for pickup? Uh, What's your name? Vanessa. What's your phone number? Four eight. Okay, that was annoying because I was speaking English and she was like, "Hold on, can I get your information?" I gave her the information and then when she saw that I spoke Spanish, she's like, "Um, we can't take orders over the phone. You have to come in in person." I'm gonna do it, but <laughs> you could have said that in the beginning. But anyway, so I got um white chocolate. I think it's a. Um, cappuccino frappuccino it doesn't say anything it was a one-man band at the starbucks um but this is my first time trying it so let's see what it tastes like it's cold hold on trap hold on mm, this thing hitting on something my butt is gonna be on fire so I'm about to order and I'm gonna see you when I order, get it, and then you know, you know. It's been about 30 minutes and my stomach is bubbling as I assumed my booty hole is on fire. And I have a 30 minute drive back. I really wanna bite into this food. It smells so freaking good. <sighs> I'm about to finally dig into this taco and see what we working with. I got two, or I got burritos. I got two because I didn't know like how big it was and it's pretty big. So I'm gonna bring the other one to Zavy. Cheers to trying new things. This smacks really hard. No kissing. This tastes just like back home. If you live in Michigan, close to Grand Rapids, you have to go to, what is it called? Tacos del Cuñado or cuñao, their burritos are to die for. I think Davey got their tacos and he fell in love. He's like, I'm never gonna try something good like that. And I'm like, I know, I've been searching, I've been hunting for tacos and burritos that taste the same. This right here, I feel like I'm about to cry because it tastes so good. Everything happens for a reason. There's a reason why the Stonex peel peeled off early because I'm supposed to come back and try this. And now I'm about to gain a lot of weight get fat but it's so worth it hispanics gain so much weight because of their seasonings and their food is just like uncomparable it's just the bomb and it's so salty but it's so seasoned and it's so delicious mm. you want to know how i knew it was a good spot because it was nothing but mexicans pulling up eating in their cars when i looked inside to pay they had like a bunch of huge calderos like the the big silver Spanish pots with um, tin foil and stuff over it. Like they spoke only English or only Spanish. Broken English definitely forces you to practice your Spanish. Oh my gosh! I might not give the other pieces. I might have to eat the whole thing. Mm. It's like 30 minutes from my house, though. Let me see if there's any of them closer. No, 
road. They're all far, but whatever. I will make that drive. That's how good they are. Mm -hmm. Yes. Every authentic taco spot need a taste like this. Whoever made these recipes, like, you deserve it all, baby. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mmm. baby. Taco spot that tastes just like back home, bro, and I'm in love. I'm over here. Go and get the motherfucking. Did you yeah. get some? <laughs> bro, it's so Bro, stop. Good. Come on, man. Come back to the house. Don't be eating them tacos in front of me like that. No, Nigga, go get the taco. Go get me four tacos. No. Bro, get me four tacos. I want four of them. Four tacos. Are you hearing me? The opposite way, bro. Nigga, so you just about to eat it? No, nigga. Go back. <laughs> What do I get in return? A fucking kid? <laughs> You're already out. See how hype he got? I'm telling you, the tacos and burritos back home was it. Okay, I don't even know why I'm still trying to eat this. This deserves to be saved. <sighs> I guess I'll see you when I get back to the house. Greetings from the toilet. Just got home, gave him the food. I guess I'll wait till I get off the toilet to see if they really like it. That coffee did some things to me. It only took an hour. I'm actually lactose intolerant. So when I go, I should really be getting like almond milk or if I'm going to be eating. Oh, what's the McBeans? Oh, crabs. Do you mind? What was I saying? Oh, yeah. So if I do drink milk, I have to take like dairy pills. So if you're lactose intolerant, if you take a dairy pill, You'll be fine. You'll feel better than fine when you eat dairy. Since I'm on a toilet, I might as well show you guys what I got from Target. I got the bags inside. Here's my phone. I got some Duo White to Clear Lash Glue. And then I also bought a Lash Trio because I'm starting to get into eyeshadow again. And when I put top lashes on, they'd be so bold and I want to have something for my bottom. So I got lashes for my bottom. I saw a couple TikToks of girls doing that. And I'm like, oh, that looks so cool. Let me try it. And then here's the cable that I bought for my iPad. As y'all saw, I was looking at hats. I decided to get this um turquoise color it's turning out more blue on camera it's a scarf and a hat to match i also got this color i didn't get the scarf i like this because it got like a hint of brown and a hint of black and it's like a nude grayish off white type of thing and i got this because it'd be hard you know i got short arms to get my back and i never had one of these i just usually struggle in the shower to get those hard to reach places so this should be interesting. It's a loofah bath brush. Then I got this. It's a lavender and vanilla bean in wash scent booster. This is my second time buying this. I'm just obsessed with it. I don't think I'll ever not have one of these scent boosters because we fall in love with our clothes. No cologne, perfume needed when you walk out the house. Your, your clothes smell fresh all day long. This is for the baby. So I bought her a jacket the other day that has like a bunch of different colors and it's fluffy. So I thought to buy her a hat that matched her jacket with some cute little gloves. But she's not going to think it's adorable when she realizes that she can't use her iPad when she has mittens on. Got a toothbrush. Make sure you're not changing out toothbrushes like every three months I think it is because ew, that's nasty. I got soap because the last one ran out. And it has to be moisturizing because if my hands get dry, my eczema starts coming back and stuff. And ain't nobody got time for that. Then I just got a regular loofah. It's so freaking soft. And that's all I got, folks. So I'm going to finish, you know, my toilet time. And we'll go check on them. And we're done. Yo, she's scared to fuck out of me, bro. You my hey. business. Don't fucking do that. Hey. Whoa, 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 girl. Why are they so hyped right now? Hey, hey, hey. So they're clearly in their zone. I'm about to get in mine. I've been out for approximately three hours and I am exhausted. I'm tired of going out. So right now I'm about to get my stuff together, get organized. Then I'm about to wash my hair, um, do a wash and go, see how it looks. Because it'll be the first time that I do one since I got my hair cut and trimmed. Since I got my diva cut. So we're going to see it's natural curls. 
I'm not going to manipulate it or anything because when she did it, I asked her for length because she cut so much and I was scared and I just wanted to see how she was going to style it. So it came out a little bit wavy, but if I do a wash and go, I don't know, it might still come out wavy because I'm not going to use like the blow dryer to set the curls in. So that's going to be interesting. If you guys want to see that video, it'll be on my beauty channel um it'll come out soon if it hasn't came out already but i hope you guys enjoyed this quick random video i guess that's what vlogtober is all about right i'm gonna be catching up on vlogtober so expect a lot more videos to drop back to back to back love you guys again i'll see you in my next video bye